bed, son? Yep, I'm all set, Dad. I'm all set. Yeah. No, no, I, I think he's trying to watch some illegal channels here. Illegal, illegal channels? This is just a uh, bad reception, honey. Who's spank my hairy ass? What's that? I bought some magazines. Well, this is the this is the uh, female form, and uh, they have uh, focused on the breasts, uh, which are used uh, primarily to uh, feed young infants, and um, and also uh, in foreplay. Right. <clears throat> this is Hustler. Now they have decided to focus more on the uh, pubic uh, region, right. uh, the whole groin area. Uh huh. Look at the expression on her face. You see that? See what she's doing? She's kind of looking right into your eyes, saying, Hey, big boy. Hey, how you doing? You see? Right. Shaved is a magazine I'm not too familiar with, but again, uh, if you flip to the center <clears throat> section, well, you see the detail that, uh, that they go into in this picture mm -hmm. here. It, yeah. it almost looks like a, a tropical plant or some underwater yeah. thing. Do you know what a clitoris is? Oh, my God. Do, well, yes, I, mean, don't I know say, what oh, a clitoris oh, you do? is. Oh, yes. I see. Yes, you do. I forgot you've been there and back. Well, I, I, you know I've everything. learned about you know, it I'm in just sex trying to make this I really don't need you to sit here and talk can, to me Jim, about this a clitoris. Is, this is you know, not, you know, know what? I, I'm sorry. It, okay, I'm sorry. Okay. I, no, no, no. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. <sighs> well, safer than a tube sock. Okay, that, the. Uh, that was good. Yeah. See you with dinner. Oh, oh. oh yeah. Oh. Oh. oh, Jim? Well, we'll just tell your mother that, uh, that uh, we ate it all. Oh, Jim. Dad? Hi, I was just uh, looking at the old family's portrait out here. Well, that was a fun day, wasn't it? Jim, I want to talk about masturbation. Now, I just want you to know that it's a, it's a perfectly normal uh, thing. And I have to admit, uh, you know, I uh, did a fair bit of masturbating when I was a little younger. I, uh, I used to call it the stroking the salami. <sighs> yeah, you know, pounding the old butt. I never did it with baked goods. Seems like just yesterday my dad picked me up after my first year at college. Mm -hmm. We popped a couple of beers and he said, now you're a man. And today I get to say the same thing to my son. Honey, your speeches embarrass him. So try and do what the kids say and just be cool. Hmm? I think I bring new meaning to the word cool, honey. I didn't do this for you. Thanks, dude. My big guy. Oh my God! Oh no! Hey! Yeah! Oh, I just—I'm not embarrassed. I—I I am. It's a perfectly normal uh, thing for two human beings Dad, uh, to what do. Are you, what this are you is, doing? This is human nature. Human nature at its best. Son, everybody does it. Your mother and I—well, uh, not so much anymore. Dad, but the, uh, oh my God! Oh, no, no, no. I, I'm going to take her to the car. Please just go. Actually, if you wouldn't mind. Honey, I'll take her to the car. Natalie, what can we hear now? Oh, oh, oh. Hi, Mama. What? Natalie? Oh, I'm Jim's dad. Oh, yeah. uh, you must be the parents of this uh, young lady. I'm sorry I didn't get her name, but uh, hopefully my son did. Ah, the one that got away, huh, son? Evidently, you two made quite the handsome couple on the internet. Oh, I didn't see it. It, uh, was brought up at a PTA meeting. This is it. This is my summer of love. Just thought I'd say goodbye to you, animals. Hey, Mr. Levenstein, how are you, sir? Hey. Come on and give your old man a hug. Keep it real, homies.
mucilage is um, dangerous territory, and uh, I would think any adhesive product uh, would have a, a warning right on the on the tube. I thought it was a, a, a lubricant. Oh. Son, couldn't you have left that disgusting thing at home? Excuse me? Well, that kind of material is offensive to me. Oh, well, uh, we're sorry. But, uh, but you see, my son uh, couldn't leave it at home because uh, he's having a bit of a medical emergency. That's right. Thanks, Dad. Your opinion of uh, his taste in video rentals, I'm afraid, is uh, not, a, not a priority, lady. Okay, Dad. Okay? It's, uh, it's at the bottom of the totem pole. Okay? Thank you. My son is sitting here right now with his hand glued to his penis. But that doesn't mean anything to you, does it? Because you don't have a penis. Or maybe you do. Dad. Sorry. Ow. Sorry. Sorry. Ow. You know, it just bugs me when, 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 when people speak before they think. You know, they speak. How you doing, son? I've been better. Boy, that doesn't look too bad, Jim. Doctor, my, my son has a party in seven days, and uh, there's a young lady coming that he's been waiting to... He's been waiting to get with. I'd tell your son to keep his pants on during that party. Oh, yes, yes, I don't believe me. I will be doing that, goes without saying. But if his pants decide to come off during the party, could he have full use of his... Um, penis. Well, here we are. You know, Jim, um, I think we should keep your mother in the dark about the little incident tonight. I think the whole glue thing might uh, get her a little queasy. I don't know how I get myself into these things. Don't forget your penis cream. Oh, my God, Michelle. Psst. Michelle, I think you need to stop. Okay, keep going. Uh, oh, my God. Michelle. 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 I got it. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, God. I made it. Where's Michelle? Uh, Washroom? You know, I was so nervous she was going to spot me. Here's the ring, son. Oh. Let me tell you something. This is some ring. Look at the rock on this baby. Mr. Big Spender. Hope you didn't blow your wad on this, son. Not yet. You look like you're ready to burst. Uh -huh. I mean, your, your cheeks, they're flush. I wish your mother could be here. Not me. That's what I wish. You know, this is, this is one of those moments, Jim, that you're going to remember for the rest of your life. Yes, it is. I cannot believe my son is going to pop the question. What was that? You got to take your pants off, man. No, it, it, it's not what it looks like. What are you doing, son? Jim, don't go in there, darling. Lord what they'll do to you. I love this dog. I, I, I was just trying son? to get him off, Dad. That is your son? Back away from the animal. Hey, great boy. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Clarity are present. Hey, where are you going? Well, uh, lunch is uh, served. Empty, honestly, now. Honestly, would you have passed up sex with Nadia? Why did she say something? Hypothetically, Dad. Oh, hypothetically. Well, I mean, you know, Jim, I'm a married man. I'm... If, if, if you weren't married? She, she's a college girl. If you were a college guy? In a heartbeat. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. First of all, what, what you're feeling is, is so normal and, and perfectly natural. Marriage is not about uh, animal lusting and, and kinky sex games. It's not so much about who's the dog and who's the fire hydrant tonight. It's, it, it's deeper than that. The longer... A marriage lasts uh, the longer you can go uh, without sex. But when that magic night does happen, uh, it's, it's all the more meaningful. And let me tell you, your mother, bless her, can still make me uh, squeal like a pig. I hope you'll be more careful with the next one. My kitchen is not a toilet, okay? Boy, pubic hair was just not an issue when I was dating. 
the ladies uh, never complained when they were, you know, down in that general area. Okay, if you never mention that ever again, that'd be oh, great. No, you're right. No, no, no. Okay. Maybe. Should should have brought it up. You wanted to see me, Michelle? Jim said that you've always kind of been there for him when he needed you, so I thought maybe you could help me. What's, uh, what's the problem? I, uh, I still can't get my vows right. Oh, I haven't been this confused since I got my first period. That's a very confusing time for any young lady. You know, your, your body is going through, uh, changes. Um, stuff coming out, stuff going in. Oh, no. I need help with my vows, not my period. Oh, your vows. Your vows. Yes. Uh, good. But it's impossible to describe a feeling. Okay, first, why do you think, uh, Michelle, they call it making love? I don't know. I just call it boning. Boning. Well, when, when you're doing other things with Jim, when you're not uh, boning, how does he make you feel? Horny, like going to bone. But, but we can't be boning from sunrise to sunset, dear. Oh, you've never tried it? I certainly have. I have. I've boned from sunrise uh, right through brunch on more than one occasion. But, but boning aside, um, I think they call it making love because uh, you have to make love work. You know, it's about compromise. And sacrifice, and, and I think Jim has sacrificed for you. My God, he shaved his entire pubic region, which would baffle most cultures around the world, but, but he did it, and, and, and he did it for you. You're right. Love isn't just a feeling. It's shaving your balls. Thanks, Dad. I, I wouldn't get uh, into too much detail on that, dear. I just want to... Oh! Stifler. <sighs> Granny. Granny, what? Focus! Focus! Uh, focus! Out! Oh. Shut the fucking door! You got it, Chip. <laughs> Look at the smile on my mother's face. Do you know how long she's been waiting for a day like this? Well, it seems like everything worked out. Oh. Magnificently. I feel a bit sad that tonight our little Michelle is going to be a woman. Honey, you don't honestly believe that Michelle is still, uh... Well, I tell you, Mary, I can't recall a single moment with either one of them that would make me think otherwise. Thank you. See? <sighs> Whoa. And together, we'll fold into the mystic. You know, Michelle, to quote someone that I've learned quite a bit from, I think you and I are a perfectly natural, normal thing. Perfectly natural.